Aris Commander Edition 2014 introduces new features for rich line editing. Let's examine how these intelligent lines can now be edited. In the command line, we can use the command rich line or use the drop-down that appears in the ribbon. Here, in the draw group of the home tab, rich line can draw parallel lines. By default, the standard style offered in Aris is designed to create two parallel lines. Let's select the command rich line and we'll draw an intersection of these lines. A double click on any rich line opens the dialog, edit rich lines, enabling you to create intersections in different ways as shown in the preview box. For example, we choose merge T to switch from a cross to a T. We press OK, click on a rich line, and then on the second one. This rich line editor is also available from the modify group in the home tab. The actual command is called edit rich line. To create a custom rich line style, we go to the application button, select options, under drafting style, go to the rich line section. We click on the new button to create a new style. We'll call it wall dividing shortened as W underscore dividing. Let's add a third line. Click New. The zero will be the center of the rich line, while top and bottom values for our rich line are the following. Here we change the color of the middle line and press OK. Select the command rich line. In the command line, write ST to choose style among the options offered by Aris. Confirm by enter and type the name of the desired style W underscore dividing and press enter again. And here's our new rich line. Now I'll draw three rich line intersections. I double click on a rich line, which opens the Edit Rich Lines dialog. I select the first option, Open T, to generate a T from a cross. Look carefully at the middle line of the rich lines. The middle line ends when it reaches the first segment of the other rich line. Now I choose the second option, Close T. In this case, the first rich line is interrupted where it reaches the other line, which in turn shows as continuous. Now we try the third option, Merge T. Unlike the first option, the middle line continues until it finds its matching line. The fourth option, called Open Cross, solves the intersection as if we use trim for the exterior lines. Note that the middle line of the first rich line is now cut. The fifth option, called closed cross, gives priority to keep the second rich line we selected continuous. Now, let's meet the sixth option, called merge cross, which makes a junction where middle lines cross each other. That's the only difference between merge cross and open cross. In this new example, double click on the rich line. I select add vertex. I click to add new vertices in rich line. By selecting the rich line, we see new grips appearing. These allow us to change the shape of the rich line without redrawing the entity. The seventh option, called Delete Vertex, helps to remove vertices. In this example, rich lines are crossing, and we use the Corner Joint option to create a corner. The behavior is similar to the Fillet or Chamfer command when applied to lines or polylines, with radius and distances equal to zero. 
Now let's discover the single cut option, which allows cuts within segments belonging to a rich line. The cut all options allows cuts that affect all segments of the rich line at once. As if we were preparing an opening to accommodate a door. Finally, we'll use the Weld All option to merge segments. So, we've been through all the editing possibilities for rich lines, and you can see how easy it is to create new custom styles. If you want to know more about this and other issues, just press F1 to launch the very complete help system for Aris Commander Edition 2014.